What's going on everybody? My name is Box from Box and Jackalope and welcome to day 11 of Panduary. Now today the prompt is Mogu and this led me to want to talk about the Rajani in patch 8.3. So the interesting thing to note about the Rajani is they're actually a new group that were forged from the Titan Keeper Raden. They ally themselves with the Golden Lotus to protect the Veil of Eternal Blossoms from the Servants of Enzoth. Pandaren and Mogu working together. This is a super interesting idea to me. For those who don't know, the Mogu and Pandaren have a pretty terrible history of war and enslavement. The Pandaren actually learned to become monks to liberate themselves from the Mogu in ancient times. Specks of their ancient empire are scattered throughout the whole land, and you can see remnants of this all over Pandario. So I know for many players, this is going to be kind of a very difficult topic to discuss, but I think it's something that needs to be discussed because it has a very high probability of happening at some point. Whether or not they join the Alliance or Horde, these mogus are allies and this is something that i think is going to really change the overall continent of pandaria long term now on the ptr it is to note there are still mogu clans that are currently attacking the veil vale, but i think this group could potentially change their whole race and potentially could serve as like a kind of redemption arc for them, if that makes sense. A good example of this is that Lorewalker Cho states that it's awesome that the Pandaren are making allies with the Mogu, and it'd be great if they could quell all the bad blood for all the years of conflict, war, slavery. And just in my opinion, I actually agree wholeheartedly with Lorewalker Cho, and in the mindset of a Pandaren, I imagine most Pandaren are very forgiving. I imagine the Pandaren would want to live in peace with the Mogu, no more bloodshed, and build a better future for Pandaria. On the flip side of the coin, I also think we could receive some very interesting storylines of Pandaren that are not accepting of this new group of Mogu. We could see some skepticism from many Pandaren leaders. I think this would be a really really great thing that maybe we could see as like a side storyline in a future expansion. The Pandaren in general have always tried to make allies with their enemies, no matter the cost. A good example of this is the Mantid. The Pandaren did try to make allies with them, although it did end up failing. This, I think, applies to the same logic that the Zandalari are in the Horde now. I think the Hoosian Pandaren would forgive them for what they did, and they would realize that the people are separate from their leaders. A good example of this is the Zandalari that assaulted Pandaria were led under Prophet Zul and not Rastakhan. And at this point, our player character would have forged some bonds with many Zandalari where they'd feel attached to the faction and would feel okay with them being members of the Horde. I think the same thing could potentially happen with the Rajani, and again, this could apply to the Alliance, the Horde, the native Pandaren to Pandaria, it's a really, really awesome thing in my opinion. And just my thoughts, guys, and I just wanted to summarize it here, I would love a future where we return to Pandaria, and we see these Mogu working alongside the natives there when we go back. I think this would be really, really awesome if we could quell the bad blood, you know, get rid of some of the evil Mogu clans, but have one that's working to build a future for Pandaria. And I would just like to recognize this would be something I think that wouldn't be easy for a lot of people to accept, but again, I think it would create a really interesting storyline for the Pandaren, actually. So anyway, guys, I know this is a very, very hairy topic for Pandaren players. I'd love to hear in the comments below what you think of the Rajani. Do you want them as an allied race? Do you hate them? Do you think it's a bad idea? Do you think Box is getting crazy for making a million videos about Pandaren? I'd love to hear below. And again, guys, I encourage you to check out Panduary on Twitter, post some artwork, post a pizza, post some burritos, post some awesome some Pandaren themed stuff though they're an awesome race and they deserve the love. Thanks again to Kath on Twitter for creating this event and we'll see you guys next time.